Hey, Pedro, what was it? What was it like catching John today and going through this experience? You know, it's amazing. It's amazing. Uh, uh, he threw a really good game today. Uh, he just worked really good. He was in the same page all day, and and this experience is just forever. You know, uh, this is my first one, and I can tell how I feel right now. Nathan Ruiz. Hey Pedro, what was the the celebration like in the clubhouse on the field? Just what was that celebration like? I mean, you know, uh, when we got the, the last out, I just uh, not, not never passed my mind like it was the third out because I was thinking about what we told uh, the next guy. He was on deck, so when I see somebody just running and start jumping, I just tell them, "Fire, good job!" and I start uh, running, just celebrate with my teammate. Dan Connolly. What was the whole ninth inning like for you, Pedro? I mean, going out there knowing that you had a chance to be part of history. Uh, you know, I, I just, uh, I'm just really happy because uh, just uh, we've been working really hard, and um, uh, every work like I've just been working like that. I mean, we show outside, you know. So he he just do a pretty good job. I feel happy myself to be on this part on the team, just uh, uh, especially young men on here. Joe Treza. Pedro, as a catcher, how much do you share in this accomplishment with John? Uh, I mean, John's a pretty good pitcher. Uh, he used to be throw a uh, um, uh, perfect game today. If you, if you, I, I, I know uh, I block. Uh, I don't got that uh, that breaking ball uh, in between my legs. So, uh, you know, I feel just a little bit uh, pretty bad. But after, like, we still throw a no hitter. We celebrate, but. Uh, you know, John Means is a really good pitcher, and uh, you guys can see, like, he's been throwing, like, a seven, eight inning, uh, one run, uh, shut out, and, you know, it's uh, it's not really hard to catch him, but just, uh, I mean, when pitcher and catch just be the same page, it's more easy for us. John Mioli. Pedro, in September, after John pitched, I think, against the Mets, you said you didn't even recognize him out there because he was pitching so differently. He was struggling so bad. What's been? What's the change been in him that's allowed him to, to pitch at this level? You know, uh, that's happened to uh, to everybody, especially young guys. Um, one month we're doing good, one month we're doing bad. You know, baseball is like an open down. But uh, l uh, last year when he pitched against Matt, you know, like a young guy, he just tried to put uh, – Try to be perfect in the song, you know. So uh, that's happened. That's happened when um, um, you don't feel really good or you don't trust by yourself. Uh, you start to like try to be so perfect. But uh, this year he just throw the ball. He just found the song, attack everybody, and and execute. That's more important. So um, he, that's why he's doing good. Or all, all this guy doing good right now. We have time for two more questions. Follow up from Joe Treza. Pedro, you mentioned the drop third strike. How do you think you'll look back on that play, or do you think that you'll focus on what you guys did accomplish at the end? Uh, no, no, really. I mean, uh, when I see the board, like on the sixth inning, we got no hitters. Uh, you know, and nothing passed in my mind because I was thinking about my uh, uh, my swing at home play. It's kind of like uh, try to pull everything right now, and I was thinking, I don't even think about no hitters. So. Uh, I just separate uh, my offense uh, when I just go to catch. So when I finish catch, I just think about my offense because I try to help the team and just get a base and, and put some run in too. So, uh, you know, finally when, when in this eighth inning, we still got uh, uh, no hitter. I just think about let's complete this, you know, let's work it on it. And, and I just just try to get a uh, remind like all these guys coming in, uh, what are we throwing? And all the are bad, they, they take it ready. So, uh, you know, it was pretty good. And last question, Dan Connolly. Yeah, Peter, just to follow up on that, um, you know, it wasn't a, a perfect game, but then you threw out that runner um, to kind of keep it as a 27 minimum. Um, how important was that, do you think, now when you look back on it? Uh, it was it was really important because, uh, you know, like I said, just uh, – Try to help the team and help the pitcher, especially I don't block that ball right there. Supposed to be my job to block that ball, especially in two strike. So uh, he is still second. I try to uh, throw my best throw to second base and just try to help Mincy 
never know if you, this guy in second base, the other guy just maybe get a base seat. So I just want to just uh, throw this guy out and just take it away and just means he's free to pitch and face the, the guys on the bad boss.